Police say a student walked inside a classroom today at Park Rose High School armed with a shotgun. The good news we can share, he was stopped and no one was hurt in all of this. We begin with a timeline of today's events and how this all unfolded. Police officers surrounded the school just before noon today after they got that call. The school was put into lockdown right away. Police say the suspect, who is a student, walked into a classroom armed with a shotgun. He was then tackled near the tennis courts on campus by head football coach Keenan Lowe. The superintendent says two students tipped off a staff member about the suspect's concerning behaviors. The superintendent says that suspect will not be returning to school. We have full team coverage for you tonight with the very latest on the investigation as it stands, how the school responded, and what is expected to happen next. We begin with Fox 12 Sarah Hurwitz. She spoke with students who were inside the classroom when that suspect walked in. And Sarah, how are they doing? Well, good evening, Liz. You know, they are processing a lot right now. They say that this all happened so fast and they are glad that everyone is OK, but they are now trying to figure out why. It was just a couple of minutes before lunch at Park Rose High School on Friday when students say they ran for their lives. A moment now replaying for these two seniors. He comes in and he has a trench coat on and he has the gun in bare sight. But he was pointing at himself like in his lower chest. Uh, and he didn't say anything. You know, I did look at him, you know, he had his eyes like really wide open. Portland police say the suspect, who is a student at Park Rose, went into a classroom with a shotgun. Seniors Alexa Pope and Izana Baru say they had split second reactions. It was fearful because when he came in, we were like, run! And I was running in a crisscross. I didn't know if I was going to get shot in my back or not. We all ran and I was trying to call a cop at the same time. I couldn't even talk to her because it was just terrifying. At the moment, my mind was kind of blank. I didn't feel my heart racing or anything. It was more just a, a reaction to getting up and running. Fox 12 confirmed the suspect was confronted and then tackled by the school's football coach, Keenan Lowe, a former standout football player for the University of Oregon. It's unclear if any shots were fired, but police say that no one was hurt and police have not released the name of the suspect, but students say he was down lately. He was in a relationship with his girlfriend in that classroom as well, same period and everything, and they broke up and he was not himself. He had his head down a lot, you know, didn't really talk much, always had a like, don't talk to me kind of face. Students say this situation at Park Rose is reminding them to check in with everyone, even if they seem OK, because you never know what someone might be going through. But they are relieved that it ended safely. These things happen and not many people get to even be in my position right now, so I'm very thankful. Certainly a lot that these students are processing tonight. Now we are told that this investigation continues into what happened here at Park Rose High School today. Uh, the superintendent does say that school will resume like normal on Monday and prom will go on as scheduled this weekend as well. If students have anything that they need to pick up that they might have left at the school, school will be open tomorrow. That's from 10 a.m. until noon. Staff will be available to escort students. Reporting live here in Northeast Portland tonight. Sarah Hurwitz, Fox 12 Oregon.